and some changes to tell you about tonight in Faustin, Minnesota. While many rural communities are struggling to survive these days, a few are still growing. Tonight, Paul Amundsen tells you how Faustin went to work to solve some of its problems. A short dedication ceremony this morning was the climax of over two years of hard work for the residents of Faustin, Minnesota. A massive development project changed the look and the feel of this small Minnesota town. Thanks to a grant from the state, Faustin was able to go on a $1.4 million spending spree. Well, this is uh, probably uh, the biggest uh, change, you know, the, uh, of our down uh, downtown uh, uh, community uh, that's ever happened uh, since uh, Faustin became a city. With the money, the city has built a new water tower, rehabilitated 40 old homes, and they tore down a city block only to rebuild it bigger and better. The buildings were 80 to 100 years old. Some were deteriorate, deteriorating to the point of, um, you know, one business owner didn't know if the wall would last through another winter. It was that bad. And then the rest of the daily specials on there. Paula Jo Cedarquist says she never thought she'd open a business in Faustin. That was before all the new development in town. Today, she was getting ready for her week-long grand opening in her new clothing store. The people that haven't been in town for, you know, four or five months come back in and say, jeepers, it's, you know, such a change in town. Every rural community realizes that they're, uh, because of the farm economy, uh, these small towns are dying, but I don't think they have to die if they, uh, if the community will get together and uh, develop a plan and say, what can we do, and then do it. Paul Amundsen, WDAY New Center 6 in Faustin, Minnesota. And now it's time to talk taxes. By now, you should have most of your W-2s and other earnings statements, and the Internal Revenue Service is encouraging everyone to start work right away on your 1987 tax forms. Our reporter, Dan Anderson, has been working on a series of reports to help you understand the big changes that have taken place in our nation's tax laws. Each night this week on our 10 o'clock news, we'll explain a tax issue that could save you money. Our closer look topic, Tackling 1040 Trauma.